Hello everyone, and we have a follow-up to the other Book of Boba Fett hobby box I opened. This is the second one that I was holding on to. If you check out the first video, pulled a base autograph of, at least it was a character, or well, a droid, that had speaking lines, and it wasn't just some background person. Um, it had been cool if it's the same guy who voiced the the droid in Return of the Jedi, but I don't know if that's true or not. I guess I can research that and find out. We've got one numbered card, and that was it, really. Not much to speak about, but this is, and this is a lower end product. I mean, I got these for $49 from my local card shop. He's just trying to get rid of them. He's still sitting on like 12 of them, and I bought these like six months ago. So maybe, depending on what I pull out of here, maybe I'll take a chance and buy a couple more. I would, I'm really trying to chase down uh, Tamora Morrison or uh, the actress who plays Phoenix Shan. I, can't, I think her name is Ming Wayna, or maybe, I think that's her name. But I'm not 100% sure. But I, I really want to get her autograph out of this. Uh, last time I did this, the autograph was towards the bottom. So we'll see. You're gonna get, we're going to get a bunch of heroes and villains inserts. Maybe one um, arsenal insert and one aliens and creatures. Maybe, hopefully more than one numbered card this time. Yeah, we got a number card out of this one. This looks relatively no, low, too. So here's our heroes and villains, Boba Fett. Oh, and it's Grogu. Gotta love that. 19 out of 50. It's, I guess this isn't... Well, they're all orange on the background. I don't know what... Oh, who cares? It's a Grogu numbered card. And then the rest of the base. So I'm going to go ahead and sleeve this one up. Cause that's a decent hit nice picture of him too center of the card it's already starting off better than the first one has a blue and I just don't want to get the auto that's uh, concept art or something like that so here's our base cards our blue parallel Wookiee pelt offering concept art which must be one actually it can't be one per because I didn't pull one they, these must be harder to come by but it's Grogu with uh, Master Luke giving him his choice Purple, two ins or an insert. So, purple of Boba Fett and those Rancor aliens and creatures, the Gamorian. Those are pretty tough to pull. Base. There's our auto, and it looked like a base auto again. That's a little disappointing. Chrysanthemum, villains and heroes. Ooh, we got a red. Two of 99, unleashing the seismic charge. So two numbered cards. Do, do, do. 
Here's the blue per blue version of the red card I just pulled. Another concept art. So that's two out of this box. Mandalorian. And the last pack before we take a look at that base auto. Another purple. Boba uh, relives his struggle in the Sarlacc pit. Another, no, this is an arsenal. Uh, seismic charge. All right, there's the base cards. Base, base, scad, heroes and villains. And, oh, well, at least this, again, it's a guy who had several lines and was in more than one episode. Oops, put that over in the wrong one. David Pasquisi as the Twi'lek major domo and i believe if they're gonna have a season two he'll be in that because he did survive and i think he works for boba fett now i don't know if i have his auto already or not i feel like I'm, maybe i do i could be wrong though could be thinking of the mayor i know i had two of the mayor i had a numbered and a base and i sold the base one So there we go. Uh, I guess I should sleeve up the other numbered parallel that I pulled. Seismic charge. That one's out of 99. Come on. And Grogu is out of 50. So those are two numbered cards definitely like this one this is one of my favorite cards out of the the whole rip um thanks for watching if you don't mind hitting the uh, like button for the video sharing commenting subscribing all that stuff help our channel grow so i can go out and buy some more stuff to open and share with you guys at some point i plan on trying to do live stream to sell some cards let me know if you'd be interested in that. And I will try to speed things up if I get a, a positive response to that. As of right now, we just list things on eBay or we'll go to card shows. There's a piece of speck of dust or something in there and sell them that way. Thanks again, everyone. Happy New Year. Take care.